I'm gonna paste the link <sighs> in the chat. This badass archer dude. Watch him hit this fucking crazy shit. And this was not the only problem with archery today. Not <laughs> real, but what we thought was historical archery only works well for modern target archery and Hollywood films. If he wanted to learn to shoot like the master archers of old, he would have to unlearn what he had learned and start reading historical manuscripts instead. What the hell? <laughs> he's... There's some people saying he's full of shit and stuff, but he's got some fucking talent. In essence, making archery as simple Jesus. as possible. It is harder to learn how to shoot this way, but it gives more options, and ultimately, it's also more fun. A war archer must have total control over his bow in all situations and must be able to handle his bow and arrows in a controlled way under the most varied of circumstances. The old manuscripts told Lars... He's fucking throwing shit up in the air and shooting it. Wow. Oh. The target, so he began practicing. It is also right in the, eye, the fucking eye. <laughs> blade so that the arrow splits into I shoot my girlfriend's dildo. Yeah! Did he just do? He just put the arrow in half with a nice. Or grab arrows while on the move and fire. Legolas. Yeah. There are even myths of archers who could grab an enemy's arrow and shoot it back at him. He's caught it. He's caught it. Jesus. Everything else is okay, but don't try to catch arrows. Perhaps most importantly, modern slow archery has led people to believe that war archers only shot at long. Jesus. However, Lars found that they could shoot at any. You just shoot two at once. Yeah. Yeah. This does require the ability to fire fast. <laughs> don't the don't fuck with the man in his chocolate milk. But since then, they started holding the arrows in the bow hand. This and shit. In the draw hand. What? <laughs> that of holding arrows in the draw hand requires immense practice and skill, and only professional archers, hunters, and so on would have had the time for it. When guns started replacing bows, this technique was forgotten. <laughs> and the only reason Lars is able to do it... Again, the audio could be half bullshit, but... I don't even have any audio. Yeah, I just turned mine off. The hard part is not learning how... Just to enjoying play. watching this guy fucking... Him properly and draw and destroy shit. registered as a lethal weapon. No matter what. Locked up He's... somewhere <laughs> where he can never it hurt anybody. <laughs> how often do you think this guy has been alone? <laughs> 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 Also works. Alive. Did you see the motorcycle yet? Yeah. <laughs> there's no doubt that those war archers of the past. Jesus balls. Yeah. Were stronger and more fit than Lars's. His arrows still penetrate chainmail armor. And I bet everyone's nice to him just because if the end of the world happens, you want him in your corner. You would want mm. this guy in your corner. <laughs> He's like fucking Daryl. To give the arrow more power. Old manuscripts tell us that I haven't seen the part where he fucks Daryl yet, but I'll watch for it. <laughs> We know that some archers held the the way, the ball was the ultimate <laughs> yeah, you know, was the joke. Escape, ten <laughs> from old texts, we know that Saracen archers were expected to be able to fire three arrows Damn. in 1.5 seconds. And very skilled archers were even faster. Something I do on the weekends sometimes when I'm not busy. Mars has managed to shoot three arrows in 0 0.6 seconds. You think this has ever gotten him a woman? Hitting the target is Doubt it. <laughs> no, he's got some pretty good skills with his hands. That could come in handy. Yeah, and you need to throw your drink over your shoulder and quickly fire an arrow at a girl. I can take your shirt off with an arrow. <laughs> I want to see the bloopers from when he tried. They're wrong. The Is that deflecting it and then incoming arrow in two with one of your own. One of them he shoots he splits the arrow in midair somehow. I mean, it's gotta be a fake arrow, but he still hit it midair. That guy's better at shooting arrows than I'll ever be at anything in my life. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, thanks thanks, <laughs> Wookie, you bring me down, man. Do we make you laugh? You can find more PJ and the Gang at pjandthegang.com. We are also on Hipcast, Stitcher, iTunes, Xbox Music Store, or wherever podcasts can be downloaded.